sorry, mate. Sorry. It's all good, mate. Mmm. Not bad. Not bad at all. You've been playing long? <laughs> Only with friends. Oh, bad luck. See, I would have got that in. You don't believe me. He doesn't believe me. Oh, hello. Ten bucks says I could beat you guys. Pissed as I am without even breaking a sweat. I don't play for money. It's just another way of saying you're shit. Play a game. Hey, I'll play you. I'm busy. A yeah. uh, hundred bucks. Heat up! Two hundred bucks. Fine. Good morning, sir. This is a random breath test. Have you consumed any alcohol in the past 24 hours? Had a couple of drinks last night. Just one long, continuous breath until I tell you to stop. And stop. Thank you. Turn off your engine, sir, and step out of the car for me. Pretty heavy stuff in there. Any thoughts? Th that was just appalling. Yes, exactly, exactly the reaction we were hoping for. Who else thought the use of the word whitey went too far? Wait, you think whitey is the offensive part of that clip? That's what it says here. What about all the other stuff? The casual racism, characters going out of their way to refer to everyone in the most derogatory manner possible, throwing racial epithets out as common adjectives in an effort to paint the filmmaker as edgy and daring. Repeated usage of these words doesn't rob them of their impact, it just creates a culture of divisiveness and destruction. What you have is an inability to recognise the face as a gestalt. She has individual features, a voice, opinions, a manner of dressing. Do you think it could be that easily fooled? No.